Hi there, Chris here. So I just checked on Starlock's channel and he's up to 140 subscribers, but still way, way, way short of his 1100 plus. So I will keep reminding people to um, sub Starlock. And I'm gonna fight this federal. It's uh, 8103P. It's a beautiful closed shackle padlock, and uh, it has some wicked bidding. Wicked, wicked. And I have picked it before with a Lishi and AM5. Let's see. Which one? An AM5 will go in here. But I'm on a single pin picket this time. I think. <laughs> I seem to be picking it with the leashy. I guess I'm just demonstrating that you can pick it with the leashy. Oops, overset. So anyway, that was that would be how you pick it with a leashy. But I've already done that. And I may have single pin picked it with one of stuff to, to set with uh, on my maybe closed shackle series. Which I still I have more closed shackles than I could show. I should bring that bring that back up to date. So anyway, as you can see, it's not a slam dunk even with the leashy. It's happening with three, nothing, four, nothing, five, nothing, six. So this is, these guys are easy to overset. Anyway, I'm on a single pin picket. So I will use top of the keyway tension. Remember, sub starry lock. And I'm gonna use probably my regular pick and maybe a little deeper hook, the law lock tools. A little bit deeper hook. Okay, nice click on one and I got started into a false set. Working my way back. There was some counter. I think I got that. I'm into a false set. I'm into losing my tension wrench. All right, recovered. That was some action, but may have dropped something. Now it's kind of, kind of dead, so I don't know. Maybe I overset something. I'm going to go way in the back and see if it's something back there, maybe. That needs picking. I, I keep falling off that one. Feels like a spool in three or four. May have got it on the switch back.
Checking pins. Counter on one. Somebody in the back. Felt like I dropped something, but I didn't get that back pin. Going to one again. Maybe not. Maybe one is set two. Still working with a little bit of a false set. And there we go. Quite a fighter. Um, let's see. I'm going to lock it back up so I don't over rotate it. And I think that's a tiny, tiny little Allen screw. Let's see. Yes. All right, so. Oh, slinky dinky dog. I can't remember what all goes on with this gut, but we'll see. Maybe the shackle just pulls out. There's a pin in there. I don't think it pushes in. I'm looking for a slot in that thing, but I'm not seeing one. So I'm going to gently bang on it. some Loctite on my hammer. I'm not getting any movement there. I might have to go back to my own video to figure out how this works. Unless it just takes a, a nice hard pull. <coughs> no. Or this way. I'm going to take some of the pressure off that and beat on it a little bit. Whoops, wrong side. Yeah, it's a little pin, look at that. Okay, now I should be able to pull it out. Oop. All right, so we got that part. Looks to me like just a um, Allen head screw. But it's longer than this. Oh, well, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe so. Do I have long Allens? Oof. Yeah, but this one might be too big. We'll see. What, Slank? Oh, okay. Now we got a spring that's coming out. But we're not to that screw yet. Maybe I can pull the spring out. in the way let's 
see. Maybe the ball is in the way. Dang, I just wanted to pick a lock for you. I hope I could see in there. Yeah, it's the ball, so. I think I got it retracted. You really have to, it's a, it's a strong core spring. Okay, that's that. So the small end goes down. Now maybe we can get the screw out. That would be a no. That would be a no. You know, it's off to the side a little bit. It's offset. No. Running out of options here. Plus, it's so deep, it's hard to see in there. Maybe the, the ball is once again getting in our way. There we go. So that comes out. This comes out and sometimes there's a little ball bearing in there. I don't see it in this lock. So that comes out. This comes out. Still no little ball bearing unless it's hidden in there somewhere. Just a second slink. This does not, now this doesn't want to come out. Hey, that bidding was easy compared to all this. Hmm. So if I go like this, <laughs> okay. So now we got <laughs> we got this out. I'm gonna as long as we're gonna be here forever. I'm gonna let Slinky out. Come on, Slinky Dinky Dog. Substory lock. Hashtag substory lock. Okay. It's kind of a tiny core for such a formidable, formidable little lock. So we're going to take this off. Still in frame? Appear to be. Stick that in there and go there. I'm gonna go back and give myself some place to pull it off. Now, I'll shim it. Said we're gonna shim it. Oh, I think I should have just picked it with the leash and called it a day. Huh? <laughs> All right, now here we go. Here we go.
So six pins. Everybody needed picking. So one, two, three, ish, four, five, six. I think that's that's a relative first. Getting those all that quickly. So everybody who's long enough uh, is serrated. So I'll show those. Nice sharp serrations. Uh, three and four are not because they're not tall enough to be serrated. When they grow up, they can get serrations. <laughs> So this would be the front of the lock. That's a standard steel. Oh, up top. Little tiny copper spring. Two is a standard, oh, two's anti-bump with a steel spring. Three is a spool. What do you bet four is a spool? Six is a spool. Five is a spool. Four is a spool. And that's everybody. And the rest are these springy, copper springy springs. Sub starry luck. So I'll show the steel spring and the anti bumpish. Just a, a little bit relieved on both ends. And I am relieved that we're done. Anyway, thanks for watching. Um, wicked bidding. <laughs> I should have re reviewed my own video, but these are these are wonderful locks. This, this part just alone is, is heavy, 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 heavy. Anyway, I wonder if a brass Abus would fit in there. Well, something, something to check. Anyway, I will see you next time. All right, mystery piece. Anybody know what that is? Put it in the comments. All right, remember, fight. Fight back for story. Hashtag st sub story luck, because we want his Saturday, Saturday, Sunday morning live back. Um, it's gonna, it's not going to be Sunday without Storylock. Thanks. We will see you next time.